Hey, what's up, fellas? I'm Ryan, certified strength and conditioning specialist from theworkoutcorner.com. You know what today is. Great day, working out, answering some questions. Exactly what we do here every Monday. Pick three questions from the comment box below. Winner of the best question gets free access to my 8020 toolkit. So let's go ahead and jump into our first question. Stefan Reppy says, hey Ryan, just want to say I love the videos and use many of your tips. Awesome stuff. Let's see. Now I've got a question. How many different exercises would you recommend doing for each muscle? I do about three or four. Is that enough? Thanks and keep it up. All right. So the, a better way to phrase this question is instead of exercises, how many sets per muscle group, right? Because you could be doing two exercises, but you know, three sets of six or five sets of five. So better to look at how many sets per muscle group and while it's generally going to vary you know based on the muscle you know, like chest obviously you can hit a lot more than say just biceps um, but a good starting range is you know six to twelve working sets uh, somewhere in there's a good way to, to get you started and and work on that all right hope that helps eli Wan says diet related question do you recommend eating out of a can? I've been eating a lot of veggies and meat out of a can. At first I thought it was good, but everything is high in sodium. Need some advice. Yeah, exactly. You've kind of hit it on the head. A lot of that stuff is really high in sodium intake, so I would try and shy away from it. Also, you know, sometimes it's going to be processed as far as the vegetables and meat, so you lose some of the, the minerals and vitamins and all that good stuff. So really, I mean, tuna out of the can is all right, but you know, when you start getting into tons and tons of canned canned vegetables again like the salt is just something you know, we want to avoid so try and go with frozen if that's easier in terms of something that's accessible to you that would be a step up and then obviously fresh being the best but you know, understand that can be tough to work in depending on your environment and when you actually get to eat all right hope that helps Julian Flores says hey Ryan once again great videos and amazing tips and advice thank you my question to you is what is an appropriate number of set and reps on shrugs for the traps I'd really like to have Traps like Tom Hardy from Bane, Batman Rises, probably the Warrior too is a better example. Uh, I currently do three sets of 10 reps with 100 pound dumbbells, thanks in advance. Yeah, you know, shrugs are a tough one, you know, as far as sometimes they just don't respond very well, or your traps rather. Um, but yeah, you know, shrugs and make sure you're doing deadlifts. Um, I would switch, try barbell shrugs instead of dumbbells, that might give you a little bit better results. And then they, they seem, a lot of studies point to that they respond generally better to lower rep range and higher weight. So maybe if you do like three sets of six, try that just for your shrugs and see if that doesn't shock them into uh, growing a little bit bigger for you. All right, hope that helps. All right, fellas, that'll do it for an episode of Mind Food Monday. Go and put your questions in the comment box below and we will get to those next week. Stefan, my man, you are the winner this week. Thank you for your question. Put a comment below so I know you saw this. Get you hooked up on an A20 course. Everybody else have a good week. I'll see you later this week with some more videos and next Monday. All right.